welcome back to my channel. Today, as you can see, I've got a whole bunch of outfits I just wanted to share with you guys, kind of like my current um, summer wardrobe of what I've been wearing and things that have been sort of inspiring me. And yeah, I thought I would share them with you today and show you some really nice looks. Even though life's sort of still been really low key, um, I haven't been going out very much, but I still like to dress up. So, let me just go and change into the first look. Okay. More difficult than I pictured. <laughs> okay, this is my first look. Now, I know it doesn't seem casual every day because of the shoes, but that is what I want to talk about for this outfit is these wedges. These are espadrille wedges, but wedges in general, the most comfortable shoe. To be completely honest, I can walk around in these shoes a lot longer than I can probably last in most of my sandals. Okay, so basically I was super inspired to get these sort of like Parisian espadrille style sandals um, from Jean Demis, who's one of my really big like outfit inspirations at the current moment, and her brand is Rouge, and they sell these shoes so cute, have them in my cart, ready to buy them, and then um, I went to Zara yesterday, got these on sale for 30 bucks. They kind of have that like Chanel ballet, you know, with the muted tone and then like the black like toe cap. I thought that was really pretty. So I got these. I like to tie the bows in the front or you can tie them in the back if you want more of like a minimal look. But um, but they are just so, so comfortable. They're so, so cute. I love them so much. Like these are going to be my everyday shoe. From now on, I have my little Jane Birkin inspired, just like a little straw bag. Like, this is what I wear every day. I talked about these in my trend alerts, like totes and straw bags. I talked about them in like probably a million videos by now that you're sick of me saying it, but I wear these every day. This one I got from like a vintage store for like literally 80 cents. So <laughs> um, this top I just also got from Zara. And um, these are like kind of my weakness. Like I can't see one and not buy it. I don't know what my problem is, but I don't actually have a lot of black ones. And this one had a lot of embroidery on the top. And that's something also I've been really loving is like a lot of like embroidery and clothing. So when I saw the top like this, had to get it. And then I just have my white Levi's jeans. I've been wearing these a lot. I'm used to wearing like just blue jeans all the time. So I thought I would switch it up a little bit and start bringing out my white jeans again, at least for the summer. And um, I love the way these ones fit. These are vintage Levi's. I did with these as well. So kind of like a mix of like a Zara sale and a thrift look. And I think it's so cute. I think it's very chic. Of course, your personal taste, you could totally switch these out for flats. But I highly recommend getting wedges because they're the easiest heel to walk and they're so so comfortable um, and I never have a problem with them and I personally just like wearing them more and um okay second look so this is my second look very comfortable I really like this denim shorts inevitable piece of the summer wardrobe I have these little vintage Levi's these were actually originally my favorite jeans, but they ripped at the butt, so I just decided to cut them into shorts, repurpose them. Here we've got this sort of same top as the last outfit. Like I said, I'm obsessed with these sort of just silky slinky little slip tops. This one's actually a bodysuit though. I did also get this one from Zara. I like this sort of like V neckline of the lace going up. I thought that was like really different. I didn't have any like this. That's always my excuse. I don't have one like this one, so I'll get it. But I did get it, and um, this is probably one of my favorite pieces in my wardrobe right now. Let me come a little closer to show you. I have this vintage Eddie Bauer printed like little sweater. I do not care how warm it is outside. If I have a cute, slouchy little vintage sweater, I am wearing it. I am. I'm wearing it because they're so adorable and you can just like kind of sling them like this or you can throw them. You can, you know, you can throw them over your shoulder. Just kind of do whatever with them in the summer. Like they're just so cute. I just love wearing them even when it's warm. Um, and then I have these kind of little comfy mules here. They're not, um, they look like Chanel, but they're not. They're Sam Edelman. And this is definitely like one of my number one tips for your wardrobe. Invest in comfortable, practical shoes. Like I know I love heels, but I'm never gonna wear them, you know? I'll wear them for photo shoots and maybe an event once or twice, but um, you need shoes for walking and something that's gonna be like really cute. That's why I kind of always get shoes like this, like little mules, something that'll be like cute with my outfits. It'll make them look dressy and um, like I'll still like get that effect of like, oh, I'm wearing a heel, I'm wearing a fancy shoe just because that's what I like but they're still they're comfortable and they're flat I knew I forgot something I have a little bag this bag is a mini little Dior saddle bag all black with the little black matte detail it's so adorable it's really teeny tiny very cute probably honestly with this outfit if I was going out like I said to the park doing whatever I would probably still bring my straw bag just because I like to bring a lot of things with me if I was going somewhere like cuter maybe like shopping that I didn't have to bring a whole bunch of stuff then I would bring like a little bag like this do something that'll look really cute with my 
outfit, but I only need necessities, you know, like my wallet, my keys, lip gloss, hair tie. That's about it. And yeah, so that is look two. On to look three. Okay, this is look number three. This is like, besides the last outfit, the denim shorts with the little slinky lacy top, this is my everyday look, like those two. If I have to get ready in five minutes, this is what I'm going to put on. It's just like a simple everyday dress, something really simple. Just said that. And ballet flats. Love it. Okay, and also I've got my other little straw tote bag. This is my Louis one. I wear this literally every single day. And, um, like, I actually have to try not to wear it. I'm like, oh my gosh, I wear this way too much. Like, can we switch it up, you know? But, but yeah, I love this dress. It's so cute. It's so simple. Super, like, just everyday wear. Like, I can throw this on with my little ballet flats, with a pair of sandals, with a pair of sneakers. So comfortable. No effort. You still look chic and cute. That's exactly my style. That's what I'm going for. So I love it. I love this t-shirt cut. I like wearing like t-shirt style things a lot more than tank tops for some reason. Um, I like the little slit, simple details of the little bow in the back to cinch the waist. So it's got the perfect fit. It's from this French brand called Vinny Bay. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. And then I've got my vintage um, Chanel ballet flats, which are one of my favorite shoes in my collection. I love them. They go with so much and I just wear them all the time because they're so comfortable. Um, I love ballet flats. I love ballet inspired like stuff in my wardrobe. Like honestly, I can be an off-duty ballerina right now with this look. Come on. You know? And then my little glasses. Maybe I'd probably like do a little like hair up with this look. Maybe I always have like a little clip in my bag for in the summer. Like I like wearing this like beachy everyday like hair, but then I always get so hot so I just end up putting it up. But Typically, I'd like to wear my hair to leave this, but yeah. So anyways, love this look. Very simple, very comfortable. Like, I can last in this all day in the heat. And dresses are so comfortable. They're a lot more comfortable than wearing, like, legit outfits. And you can put them together in five minutes. So, next look. Okay, here's the next look. Okay, here's the next look. I don't know what number we're on. Is this number four, number five? I don't know, but this is another really comfortable everyday look. I've got a white t-shirt, a long, slinky black skirt. Super simple. I love wearing maxi skirts. They're like one of my number one wardrobe favorites right now, which is funny because I never would have thought this is something I would wear because I used to not like skirts like this, but they're so comfortable. This is a lot more comfortable, honestly, than like jeans and a white t-shirt. So um, I really like wearing this. This white t-shirt is from Club Monaco. I've got my same little bag. I did tie it, so it's got like this little crop effect. I'll either do this or I'll just like tuck it in either way. It gives us just a little bit of a different look. I've got my little brown flat sandals from when I worked with Boohoo. I wear these so often. They're so comfortable. They sort of got that like Hermes look to them, which is why I got them. And I really like the mix of brown and black. Plus, like I said, um, I've given this tip before, matching the shoes in the bag. So because there's brown detail in the bag, I prefer to wear like brown sandals. And then this skirt is actually from a Scandinavian brand that I really, really like I'm probably going to say the name wrong, but it's like Road. Let me look at it. Roadger. I'm not sure how to pronounce it, but it's a very lovely brand. Such cute stuff, and I got their skirt, and it's very comfortable. I like the length on this because a lot of times when I get maxi skirts like this, they're way too long on me because I am on the shorter side. So um, I really like this one because it's perfectly high waisted. The fabric is really, really soft and comfortable. It's not too thick, so for the summer, it's very breathable, and it's like the perfect length. So I really like this one. Is that it? Next outfit. <laughs> okay, this next look we've got is a very comfy look. It's literally just like an all white oversized look. Just like some oversized nice white pants, an oversized blouse, which this was in my wardrobe essentials. I wear this all the time. It is one of my favorites. And um, I've got like a dressier bag, again, with that juxtaposition, just to sort of like make the outfit not look too, like, you know, dressed down with the super oversized pieces. I like to add like a girly element, um, especially when I'm wearing something like this, like I've got a men's shirt on and sneakers. So I'll normally wear like some nice blingy gold jewelry and like I'll wear my hair down, cute bag, something like that. Like I just sort of love this look. I'm very in on the oversized. Um, and again, these fabrics are like really breathable. In an all white look, I mean, it's summer. How can you not have a really cute all white look? So I really like this look. Very like, very comfortable. I could be wearing pajamas right now, you know? Um, and yeah, very fun look. So yeah, next look. <laughs> And now the last look. So for my last look, um, it's kind of similar to look two, just like the everyday dress, but just a different one. This one's kind of like a cuter, fancier dress, so I decided to dress it down with sneakers. I have this one, it's short, kind of flowy, but again, really simple. 
And then I also, my sneakers are Reeboks. I have my little black bag again. And usually when I wear stuff like this, I always bring like a little like either spring jacket or again one of those little vintage sweaters with me just in case to like tie around or whatever. So I have this blazer just because this is really cute. I would bring a blazer more for if I was like in the city, more like sweater if I was going to like a park or a beach or something like that. Um, so I guess it really just like depends on whatever. That's just kind of like to help out, dress it up a little bit, make it really cute. And yeah, so that is my last look of this sort of summer, I don't even know what I'm calling this, summer outfit ideas, summer looks, whatever it may be. I hope that you guys enjoyed, maybe you guys enjoyed these looks, got some inspiration, um, and yeah, thank you so much for watching, make sure to subscribe to my channel for more fashion videos. Also check out my social media, I love you guys so, so much, and I'll see you in my next video. Mwah.